here we are in Blackboard. We're looking at a simple course that has a few units, a unit on animals, a unit on plants. We're going to want to take a look at how we can create some links so we can jump around from one place to another within the course. Now I can always put a link in the course menu. That's pretty easy. I need to have edit mode turned on and then I go to the plus sign here. I can go to class link and now I can browse for the exact page in this course that I want to link to. Or I can do a web link which would allow me to link to a website. I just put in the URL to that website. But it's going to put that link here in the course menu. What if I want to link within my course? Well there are some different ways we can do that. Let's take a look at what we have here first. We have a, a unit on animals. The unit on animals has a few learning modules, one on invertebrates, protozoan, annelids, and then there's a learning module on vertebrates, things like fish, amphibians, reptiles, and so on. And then we also have one on plants. So let's say in the vertebrates, you'll notice down here I have a folder with some project files. And in vertebrates, let's say with the reptiles, I want to be able to click on these words and go to that project folder where there's a reptile project file. So I'll turn edit mode on. I'll turn on edit in the reptile page. I can go to full screen by clicking here. Now I can highlight these words and I want to link to them. But I don't have any link to put in there yet. So I'm going to have to find the link. I'm going to have to find the place where I want to link to. So that was here. It was in the animal project file and it was this right here. So I can look at this item I, with edit mode on. It just seems like if I turn edit mode off, it doesn't give me a link option. But when I turn edit mode on, it does. So I right click, copy link address. So now I've copied the address to this spot in my course. So now let's go back to animals it was in vertebrates and it was down here in reptiles. I'll edit the reptile page. I will highlight these words, click the little link, and now right up here I'll paste the link. I'm going to use keyboard shortcuts so on a PC it's control V, on a Mac it's command V. And now the link to that part of the course has been pasted in. I have some options that we don't have to look into right now. You can do that. I'll insert it. And now I want to submit. I'm going to turn edit mode off. I'm going to go to reptiles. I'm going to click on the words see reptile project. And it takes me to the part of the course where I have the reptile project. I actually put another link in here, return to reptiles. So now I can go back and read more about reptiles. I've linked those two parts of my course so that I, the, the, your student can go back and forth easily. Here's another example. I'm going to go to a different course, a very large course, where I decided a course outline map might be a good handy thing to have. So all of these pages are linked to parts in the course. There's one that I left blank here. So I want to find your home screen, and it would be right here. Now with edit mode off, I can grab that link. As long as I click on that page, I can right click and I can copy the link address. With edit mode turned on, it doesn't let me do that. I can't grab them from over here but I can go down now with edit mode on and I can grab 
that link right from here, from the item icon. So it's really up to you how you want to do it. Just remember if you can't find the link that you're trying to get, if it doesn't give you an option, toggle the edit, the edit mode and it'll let you do it. So back to your home screen, right click, copy link, go back to my course map, turn edit mode on, this is the place in my course that I want to link it to. I'm going to click over here to expand this, give, make it full screen. Your home screen, highlight the words, link, control V or command V on a Mac to paste, insert, go back out of full screen and submit. And now I go down to your home screen and it takes me to that part of my course. So this is how you can link from one part of your Blackboard course to another. Just remember whether the edit mode is on or off has something to do with different types of whether you're, you're linking learning modules or items or folders. Some like the edit mode on, some like it off.